Hi, my name is Damon Harris with the Office of Business Management District 4. I'm here to talk about a few projects that Facilities Management is working on here in the district. These projects are energy efficient, equal friendly, and provide a safer work environment for employees. The first project that I would like to talk about is improving our lighting system here at the district office. We partnered up with PG&E to determine our current status and we found out that it's inadequate. They recommended that we upgrade our system to T8s. By upgrading our system to T8s, not only will we become energy efficient, but cost effective also too, along with actually bringing natural light to the building. By doing analysis of the building, we found out that we would actually save 700,000 kilowatts of energy per year by switching out from our outdated T12 to T8 lighting system, which it translates to a savings of $100,000 per year. TAs are not only cost effective, energy efficient, but also to provide natural lighting to employees to provide a safe work environment for all. The second project I like to talk about is the District 4's Green Fleet. In 2000, the department made a plan to make sure that we lower our harmful emissions here in California. Today, the district has 218 E85 vehicles throughout various locations through the nine Bay Area counties. There are also 10 public locations to fuel E85, and there's one bulk fuel site at Burma Road Pier 7. In 2010, we started tracking E85 usage by our vehicles. As of halfway point in 2012, we're averaging 225 gallons per month at our public sites and 1,500 gallons at our bulk fuel site. Our goal is to improve upon E85 usage at the public sites to an average of 1,200 gallons per month by telling employees the benefits behind E85. District 4 is committed to increase the amount of E85 usage by our vehicles and reduce air pollution to California. The last project I'd like to talk about is regarding employee safety at the district office. As part of the seismic retrofit that was completed in 2010, we installed a seismic monitoring system. This system monitors the horizontal and lateral movement of the building using GPS devices located throughout the building. This information is transferred to a computer which calculates all this information to determine in case there is a seismic event if there's any damage. This gives us the ability to not only figure out if the building is safe to occupy, also to, to determine exactly where the damage is caused. This system is set up to provide real-time data which allows facilities to decide if the building is safe or not. As a result, the information provided gives us the ability to determine that the building is safe to occupy or evacuate. This is another key component here in the district office that ensures the safety of our employees. I'd like to thank you for listening today, and I hope that you enjoy the iFair 2012.